My name is Latrenda Ross. I'm the committee woman for the 4th Ward 4th District here. And this is National Night Out. Um, it is so important for community policing um, because it protects the safety and awareness of our residents. And as you can see, it's such a wonderful day here. Hi, I'm Jake Stiber. I'm a uh, commissioner on the Hoboken Housing Authority, and I'm thrilled to be here tonight. This is a fantastic event. Um, it's, it was great last year. It's great this year. Um, and it's just a great night for uh, people from the community to come out and come together. Carmelo Garcia, executive director of the Hoboken Housing Authority. National Night Out is instrumental to the families because it builds trust. It establishes a relationship between our police officers who are in the trenches working with the families and that of our residents. The citywide annual National Night Out has become a huge success. Community policing is an integral part in raising awareness in making sure that there is a preventive and proactive approach to reducing crime and to ensuring that our families feel safe. Hi, my name is Tim Acapinti. I'm a fourth ward resident and I think it's a great opportunity to bring the police of our community and our children and residents out together in this, this great event for uh, National Night Out. It, you know, it's, it's inspiring to see that the police working together with the community to help prevent crime and um, drugs and violence here in, in our community. And it, being a part of a nationally recognized event, it's, it's just wonderful to see everyone out here enjoying themselves and, and the kids having all smiles on their faces. and. That's what it's all about. My name is Ravi Bala, council member, member at large of the city of Hoboken. Just want to thank the Hoboken City uh, Police Department and the residents of, uh, of the 4th Ward, 3rd Ward, the Hoboken Housing Authority for all coming together, together on this national night out against crime. It's a great opportunity for the police department to display the services that it can offer to the local community and also for residents in Hoboken to learn how they can partner up with local law enforcement to address and communicate some of the problems and issues happening in the area. So I'd like to congratulate the Hoboken Police Department. I'd like to thank the members, thank the residents of Hoboken. I wish you a great, happy, fun night out. Thank you. My name is Francois Ivory, and I just want to tell you the many wonders about National Night Out. Like, first of all, it's the good food that they have everywhere. Like, sometimes they'll have cakes, they'll have hot dogs and cheeseburgers, and it's awesome. They'll have carnival games and other things like a bounce house and a slide. And, if, and sometimes if it's really hot, you can go on this water slide and it's awesome. They have awesome music and you get to dance and show off your own personality. You can have fake, you can have um, balloon boxing and that's really kind of, it's really fun. You can show off and you can have a little glory for the day. And some parks, they have other things like basketball games or other Cotton candy machines or popcorn machines or maybe frozen cones. And well, today they have cake, which is like the best thing. So if you ever get a if you ever get a chance, I suggest that you and your family and friends should come to National Night Out. Good evening. My name is Anthony Falco. I've been chief of police since 2009 June, and uh, I'd like to just say a few words about National Night Out. 
underwater? It's in the, the past years, uh, you don't see much of a focus on it, but I'm a, I'm a big believer. Look, look, look what's going on around us here. To see the community come out in the street and have this relationship with members of the police department, it's important that, that we keep this, this uh, national out going. It's important that we get funding for it. Funding has seemed to dry out. Community policing, it's another area in which, because there are no funds, that we've had, re we've had to reduce our force. Uh, look, what, look what they put into this, the organization, the time, how the people respect them down here, and we're gaining a trust. This, was, this is why I'm a big believer in community policing. It should, it should be here, funding should be here, and I, I hope that we get the support that we need to continue these programs and many more that are beneficial to both the police department and the citizens of Hoboken. So enjoy the evening and looking forward to seeing you next year. My name is Dawn Zimmer, I'm the mayor of Hoboken, and I think National Night Out is a great night for our community to come together. Really appreciate the work that the police department does, um, putting all of this together. We had a Jaws of Life demonstration, the ambulance corps is down here, the fire department comes down. It's really getting everyone together, um, coming together as a community and, and uh, thinking about the issues that, that impact our community and, and really appreciate all the work that they do. I'm Officer Jim Barber with the Hoboken Police Department. I'm part of the Community Policing Bureau. This year I was one of the National Night Out event coordinators. National Night Out is a great way to strengthen the partnership between the community and the police. This year's event was a complete success with close to 1,200 people in attendance. I'd like to take this opportunity to thank the many agencies and businesses that contributed to the success of the event. ShopRite for their generous donation of food, water, and ice. All in One Entertainment and their crew for providing the rides. Hoboken Housing Authority's Carmelo Garcia. Carlos Bakery for providing the cakes. National Guard for their rock wall and the time. Hoboken Fire Department for their demonstration of the Jaws of Life. Mile Square Towing for their donation of the car. Hoboken Volunteer Ambulance Corps, New Jersey Transit. State Police, Port Authority, Mrs. Waiters. Oscar Mercado for all the cooking that he did and Sammy Fermente for his tireless running around. On behalf of the Hoboken Police Department and the Community Policing Bureau, I extend my gratitude to everybody that participated and the community for showing up. Thank you very much.